Welcome back to the channel everyone on this great sunny and hot summer day. We're back at Bella Vista RV today so thank you to them. They've given us a call that they've gotten in some hideout single axle trailers and we've noticed on the channel a popularity for smaller lighter weight channels so we thought we'd run down and take a look. This one here is a 2023 186SS. Yes, the first of the 2023s to hit the lot. Now the 186 is an 18 foot trailer, single axle, weighing in at about 4,200 pounds. But the big surprise is that, yes, it has a nice big slide on board. So something a little bit different from what we've been looking at with some of the non-slide or small slide units. Let's take a little look around the outside. Couple of things, this does have a Solar Flex 200 package, but you do get the solar plug-in that's on the outside as well. A nice power awning with LED light strips. You do have the solid step and even a little bit bigger grab handle. As I mentioned, it does have the Solar Flex 200, which gives you a solar panel up top. We have our dog leash here as well as that not only being a dog leash, but it's also a bottle opener. Single axle, as I mentioned, black rims, which is nice. Outside power plug to plug in your electric cooktop grills, etc. Now, being an 18-footer, it has stabilizer jacks, but these are manual jacks. So you'll need an impact driver or a drill with a three-quarter inch socket and that way they're essentially a semi power jack by doing that. Spare tire which is very important and then it is backup camera prep and they don't do hideout doesn't do the Furion prep it's a prep that will take the Furion camera but it's a little more of a generic setup so you have a couple of choices of cameras out there that you can use and then as I mentioned the slide out it's a really nice good size slide so let's take a walk inside and take a look at a few of the features that happen to be inside when you walk in first thing you'll notice is a nice large large looks about a double bed in here there is a shelf above the bed for additional storage and a wardrobe but really important windows with screens for cross ventilation so if you're doing some dry camping which I know a lot of people are buying small units to get off the beaten path you've got a lot of windows here and they're all screened to let natural uh, air flow through now we have a hide a bed style sofa or a futon style I should say so that'll fold flat for sleeping there are some drawers that they've put into the base and the slide out is just on top of that we have a nice dinette that also converts into sleeping so for example this is already in the sleeping mode all we need to do is slide out the cushions and boom you've got your sleeping area single sink with two burners. We are a little smaller unit, so we've got to keep things a little more compact. Microwave on board with our storage cabinet above. Now, I've mentioned this in other units, but you actually haven't seen the speaker. Here's our Bluetooth speaker just mounted there by the door. We can take it outside and listen to music. On our roof, we have a rooftop air conditioner, not a wall mount. Now, we also have a nice large double door fridge. And this is a propane electric fridge, so really good for dry camping. Our water heater is a gas water heater on board. Here's our convenience panel, so we can check our gauges, turn our water pump and our water heater on and off. We have a decent sized washroom. Again, we're 18 feet here. So we have plastic toilet to keep the weight down, a little bit of storage under the sink, decent amount of counter space for a small unit. And as we've pointed out in other hideouts, we have an inverted outlet that's part of that solar flex panel because we are prepped 
for an inverter. Medicine cabinet, hi everyone, for some additional storage and a good size shower. Plus, in the back here, look at the storage that we have. We've got a really good wardrobe cabinet that actually goes further back. We'll open up a couple of more spaces for you here. Really good storage throughout. This is actually in a small unit, one of the best storage configurations I have seen so far. And then with that slide out, as I spin around, you'll notice how open this layout really is. So if you're looking for something small, I, I hope this video will bring you an alternate floor plan that maybe you haven't seen already. You've got Solar Flex 200 on board with the solar panel, it's already there. If you need something like a CPAP machine, etc., you can throw an inverter and have that flexibility with the inverted outlets. Uh, special thank you again to Bella Vista RV for letting us know they got these brand new 2023s in that we can come and shoot them for you so you can take a look at these floor plans. Thank you to you, our viewers. If you like the video, please click the like button, hit that subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. We're trying to push past 10,000 subscribers. And check back soon for more videos. We have another single axle 2023 we're going to shoot today as well, and it'll be posted shortly on the website. Make sure you live life to the fullest, and we'll see you out there in the campgrounds. Take care.